Now, I remember when living in Japan, I can't really recall hearing Ikigai other than a few occasions when I was introduced to it. It's interesting because I guess if you're pursuing it or seeking it, it would suggest you don't have it. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, that's right. And then if you're not seeking it, yeah, it's obviously something that's part of your life. But I imagine even in that context, most people wouldn't be thinking, oh, you know, this hobby of mine's my ikigai. They'd just be thinking, oh, you know, I really enjoy this hobby or I really enjoy seeing my my grandchildren. I agree. So it's interesting how <laughs> it's I think it's we have more of like a more lighthearted stance mm. towards the word and the concept. And we don't necessarily kind of write it on the wall, right? Yeah. And and basically try to pursue it every day. Well, you certainly don't put it in the center of a Venn diagram. <laughs>